السلام عليكم ورحمة الله. فيلك أود لك تقول كم إبريبات من دروم إبريبات يقولك ولكم إكسكلوزين أوف كورس الشيعة. أنا أود لك لك نذكر بي هاف مانز. هات ناو يو آر يو ريبريزنت يو ريليجن. نو؟ تين كوزيز مين في إيديا تستيبت ستاك لايك ذات. We sound weak. All right? So let's have a respect debate without calling names, okay? We're going to have a debate. Uh, the, the topic of the debate is the Torah, the Word of God. The debate is going to be four segment, uh, three segment, 20 minutes, second 15, third 15, the last one is 20 minutes. So you have two segments, the first one and the last one 20 minutes, second and third 15 minutes. The topic of the debate is the Torah, the Word of God. Uh, the, uh, the, the debate is directly from uh, the Torah, nothing from Quran, nothing from Christian religion, only from the Torah. That's it. If I mention anything outside the Torah, read that me, same for him too. Okay? Let's start, please. Again, welcome everyone to the room, Muslims and non-Muslims alike. Um, as Brother Hussain have said, we're going to start the debate. Four segments, four intervals, 20 minutes, 15 minutes, 15 minutes, and then conclusion at 20 minutes. Uh, Mr. Pete is going to start. And uh, Mr. Pete, all what you have to do to uh, use the uh, Torah or the Old Testament, just name the verse, number, and it will post it for you on the text. الأخوة تغلق البرامج التنقيط الآلي الأخوة تغلق برامج التنقيط الآلي والطرد الآلي Invite everyone Mr. Pete, the mic is yours for the first segment of 20 minutes Go ahead I don't know who made this 20 minutes I don't think um, uh, our God needs to be proven in 20 minutes It could be proven, I think, in much less But we'll see um, First of all uh, the, the Bible is the only book, the only book that claims, that, that's a claim a book from God that claims national revelation, okay? It's the only book that claims that it was given to all the people who were there at that time. Millions of people saw it. It's called national revelation. And lo and behold, the book also says that no other religion will be able to claim national revelation. All other religions who claim, claim that they only got it from one man. One man came up and he said, I drink this, I had this uh, revelation, I had this revelation, and that revelation. No, and... And in, in Judaism and in the Torah is the only book that claims, okay? Hold on, let me post the verses. That claims that God spoke to all the people, and God spoke all these words saying, I I am the Lord thy God who brought thee out of the land of Egypt, out of the house of bondage, thou shalt have no other gods before me. You notice it didn't say, I'm the Lord the God who created the world. Well, they don't know if he's the Lord of God created the world. This can be, we, we, they weren't there. But they were there when God brought them out of Egypt. So they know that this is the true God. Only a God can have such a powerful to bring him out of Egypt. And then he spoke to all the children of Israel. No other, the, of all the false religions, no other religion can claim that their God spoke to them. In, in fact, some say that God spoke, in fact, in a, other religion, it doesn't even claim that they don't even claim that God, that the God spoke to their prophet. <laughs> So therefore we know, uh, um, a Muslim once asked me, um, he asked me, how do you know, what if you find out that your religion is false? What are you going to do? Well, I can tell him I have a claim. I can say that millions, uh, this religion claims that millions of uh, uh, people, have, uh, 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 millions of witnesses. Okay, stop PMing me Muslim guys. Now, this, this religion claims that it has millions of witnesses. 
See, now, wait, close my PMs? Okay. Let me, um, okay, anyways, now, it also, God spoke to the children of Israel, and this, and this is known in, in, in all other religions, it's, it's based on the true religion. Let me just, uh, could you, hold on, okay. Stop PMing me, I told you Muslim. Okay, I gotta stop. Let me, let me just give you, give you a second here to close your PM. Stop the time. Please stop the time. And I don't think these are uh, Muslims that are PMing you, Pete. They're probably Jews PMing you to help you. Okay, close your PM. Do you know how to help, to close your PM? Do you know how to close your PM? Go to the main menu. Go to the main menu. Okay. On the main menu, you will see, you will see File, you click on File, you choose Setup Preferences, okay, and you choose Privacy, and on the Privacy, you can see who can contact me. And you go all the way down and choose allow contact from pal list only. Allow contact from pal list only. You got it? This way you're welcome. Beat anytime. So now we're gonna resume. We're gonna resume the timing once you take off once you take the mic again. And again, here is in this room we are discussing, we are debating. Is the Torah word of God? There is no references to any other religion. And no one should feel in contempt here. You're all welcome. Go ahead, Mr. T. The mic is yours. Okay. Okay. So, so um, that's what I said. And also, um, in most other religions, they don't have a continuous uh, uh, prophecy. In most false religions, they have usually only one prophet because it was. It's very hard. To, um, to continue one prophet to know what the other prophets say if it's false. Only in Judaism, only religion in Judaism, that it has lots and lots of prophets afterwards to confirm. Every prophet who came afterward confirmed um, what the Torah said and didn't go against the Torah. So, and, and, uh, and God spoke to, uh, and in and in the, the, the Torah religion, the Jewish religion, the children of Israel, God spoke to all, every prophet, not through an angel, and uh, only, uh, uh, sometimes through an angel come first, but always directly. So that's how we know that the religion of Judaism is true. First, that it had um, uh, it had a national revelation. Now, if it if it wasn't true, the the people would have said there millions of people would have said it isn't true. Somebody would have wrote that it was that it isn't true. They, someone would have denied it. Uh, uh, you say somebody would have said, let's say in, when the Torah was given, it said um, it said that uh, the the, the sea split. Somebody would have wrote, "Hey, I was there at that time, and the sea never split." This is a, this is not a true book. No one has ever written that. Later on, millions of years later, they say um, the book isn't true. The sea never split. But no, millions of people never wrote it at that time. In fact, the whole world n n didn't write that the um, that the Torah wasn't true. Everyone saw, and the Torah reveals all the stories that everyone knew. That uh, um, it, when they went out into the desert, they had to have a lot of battles because the people knew that it's the true religion, and uh, uh, and uh, and uh, they wa they wanted their God feel their God is stronger. That's why they fought against the Jewish. And the, and and the Jew and the God always helped the Jews, and no one was killed in these battles. That's how we know that the Jewish religion is true. Okay, that, and and that's all I have to say. I don't need 20 minutes. I already proved that the Jewish religion, that the that the Torah is the word 